Hey guys, it's uh, Sunday morning. It is late. It's about 9.30. Um, out of Florence Flea Market. So, we are walking around. Just wanted to show you guys. I uh, bought out a booth already. So we're going to go load that up. I'll show it to you guys in just a few minutes. But wanted to kind of show you guys a, a heads up of Florence Flea Market. I'll flip it around. See if I can get a little film for you. Sorry, I had it angled down. I'm trying not to bring too much stuff on the camera. Um, I try to respect most of the people walking around and stuff like that. And I'm not real great at editing, so I try not to get their faces. So I have it always facing down a little bit. Till I can get a GoPro and, well, I have a GoPro. Till I figure out how to use the GoPro is probably the best way to put it. But there's some really nice shoes. Some real good other items. And uh, lots of glass and stuff like that. I see a Harley shirt over here. Nineteen ninety two. Lucky brand jeans over there. I gotta learn I gotta learn my clothing. You guys gotta help me learn clothing. So this is the market. This is one of the two aisles. There's two aisles over here. I bought you guys some glass this morning. I bought some sterling silver jewelry. And I bought a big die cast car NASCAR collection, which I'll show you guys in just a few minutes. I'm actually finishing up. I'm just doing my probably my third or fourth round around a flea market. A lot of people set up, some people leave, other people come. So you got all kinds of video games. I bought a group of uh, garbage pail kid cards. They got chickens out here. Anybody buy chickens? That's some fresh chicken over there. Lots and lots of tools. Lots of tools today. So let me see if I can get you guys some other footage. Um, once I get up there to, to the booth I bought out, I bought some Rob Zombie um, t-shirts and other cool items. So hopefully you guys like it. Okay, so sorry about that. I just bought a Unisphere inflatable ball. So lots of nice items. Just really amazed. Postcard. Oh, some photos. Take a look at. It. Okay, guys, it's about 20 minutes went by. Totes are pretty empty, but. This is what the car looks like. Hey, we didn't have bags or boxes for this stuff, so and he wanted to keep the totes. So uh we got stuff and then these garbage bags are completely full. So I'm gonna bring it all to auction, gonna sell it cheap. Hopefully make a profit. Um so I think we spent in all today I spent uh about six hundred dollars and I'll show you guys in a a little bit once I get home and can get it a little spread out what I got okay I'm back at the house and I just finished taking all of the loose NASCAR out and filled this box this box that box that box this box this box there's extra stuff on top there's even a few more pieces here <clears throat> so that's all like the die cast NASCAR both of those bags are completely full you can see more there. So all boxed. I actually found some surprises. Like there's some cars of like Richard Petty. And they're actually signed. So those were kind of cool. But here's everything else I got today at the flea market. So got this really beautiful vase. I bought it. I can't make out the marking on the bottom. So somebody. Vacuna maybe. Vacuna. Maybe it goes this way. But it was a really nice looking vase. I got this whole thing of Playmobil, which is really cool because all the accessories are here. 
Got this little bag of enameled pins and things. Got some California raisins, some of the vintage California raisins. This one's even in the package, which is kind of interesting. I got a, some jewelry, which I'll show you last. I got these three shirts, Gyro's Scream Fest, but look, inside has Rob Zombie Presents the Devil's Playground. Here's another Rob Zombie t-shirt. And here is an awesome human blood, keeps them alive forever, Rob Zombie Triple Shock Scream Show. The tag has been cut out, but really nice. So those are going to come to auction. We have three Jurassic Park um, air fresheners, a really nice piece of crackle glass like mid-century modern. This is a music box right here, an Inesca music box. Magician with a rabbit in his hat. Then this box here is, you guessed it, Garbage Pail Kids. So we got that this morning. There's also some sports cards in here. Um, I'm actually getting ready to leave and go possibly buying a sports card deal. So wanted to get this video shown to you guys quick. These are all sterling. Uh, this is from the lady that brings me a lot of sterling. Those are obviously like little turtles. Some really beautiful sterling, silver. Every bit of it's marked. <clears throat> so those are glass beads in sterling and then sterling and different kinds of stones. This one's really beautiful case fine jewelry in Aruba. Those are awesome and those are sterling. The bracelet here is Mark 925, really nice, with the garnets, a Savorsky crystal turtle, some more sterling, a really nice little bracelet with a turquoise piece in it, and items like that. The other jewelry I got was a beautiful strand of pearls. As you can see, they're individually knotted between. They're gritty on the teeth. So I might have to do a little more research to figure out what pearls are worth, but these, this is my favorite buy. So these are black pearls. They're knotted in between each one. We tested the in-between beads. They are 14 karat gold. So a really nice pearl band. Um, the lady I got it from had this, she just kind of threw it in. She said she thought it was coral. I think it's some kind of a stone. If anybody out there knows what it is, let me know. I'm still learning jewelry, and I just like to buy it to bring to you guys at the auction. So that's what we picked up today, along with the NASCAR collection. I And I did get a box of records. I forgot I moved them over here. So records and some laser disc in there. Okay, guys, hope you enjoyed the video for today. We probably spent around $600 in total, and we'll see what it brings at the auction. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Hope to see you then. See you at the auctions Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday from 1 p.m. till 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on our YouTube channel, where we sell to you guys. Thanks, guys. Hope you enjoyed.